Okay, hey guys, it's MegaFX here, and today I'm back with another tutorial video. Um, a friend of mine asked for a uh, for a tutorial for this effect right here. I'm gonna show it. For this effect, many many shoots. So I'm gonna show that today in this video. So what you gotta do is make a new uh, a new video track. Um, make a cut where you shoot. So that's like right here. And I'm gonna end it like right. Let's see. Gonna end it right here. So if you zoom in, you got this clip right here. So uh, what you gotta do next is go to media generators, solid colors, white, and then place it on top of the clip you want it on. I am gonna make it a little bit shorter because it's just too long. Okay, so I'm gonna make it this length. So what you gotta do now is uh, go to the generated media tab and go to color and set this all the way down. <coughs> so you just can see through it like this. Then I'm gonna add some fade offset to it. Let's see. Okay, so what you gotta do next is um, go to, let's see, go to, go to transitions, then iris, and then circle out white border, this one, drag it onto the, the white color, and if you see you have it like that so I'm gonna uh, hold control and drag this out a bit so it's slow-mo a little bit okay so what you gotta do now is go to um, compositing mode and set it to custom then uh, go to Sony height map uh, click add um and then what you gotta do is if you see it like right here there was a shot so I'm gonna set this to wrap pixels around so it looks nicer and then if we view this you see that's a shot um so yeah that's it it's pretty easy you can do a lot of stuff with it you can do it with uh, with a machine gun but that's gonna be harder because you have a lot more shots but uh, but yeah if you like this tutorial please be sure to leave a like and a comment uh, and yeah that's it I'm out peace